Passing drills are essential in football, forming the backbone of effective team play. They improve individual skills and teamwork, fostering communication and strategic awareness. This video features five key drills to enhance your game. It's crucial to grasp the fundamentals of wall passing when practicing solo. Never underestimate the significance of mastering one and two touch passing against the wall. You don't even require cones, just concentrate on maintaining ground contact with the ball while enhancing your pace of play. Ensure you practice one touch passing with both feet, two touch passing alternating feet, and two touch passing with the ball touching your opposite foot before making the pass. Additionally, practice using the outsides of your feet for two touch passing to foster comfort with the ball. Don't overlook these fundamental drills during your training sessions. All right, transitioning to the initial drill, you'll only require two markers or cones as you can see. Here, we're focusing on the inside foot touch. Move side to side, utilizing your left foot in one direction and your right foot in the opposite direction. This skill is vital for maneuvering into open space and positioning your body to have a clear view of the field. For the next drill, let's introduce one more marker, totaling three. This setup will help refine your skills. Your task is straightforward. Play the ball against the wall and execute a touch with the inside of your foot, directing it towards your opposite foot to set up the pass. Throughout this drill, maintain a fluid movement, alternating between forward and backward motions. Stay attentive to the positions of the markers, ensuring you adapt your movements accordingly. Focus on mastering the weight of your passes and the control of your touches. Remember, in a real game scenario, you'll frequently need to navigate in multiple directions to create advantageous space for receiving the ball. This drill serves as excellent preparation for such situations. All right, let's dive into the initial partner passing drill. We prefer beginning in close proximity and gradually expanding the distance between us as the training session progresses. For this drill, you'll only require two cones once again. There's a specific pattern involved. One partner passes straight while the other passes diagonally through the cones. After a few passes, switch roles. This drill challenges you to move swiftly and think on your feet as you aim for crisp one-touch passes along the ground. It's a fantastic exercise for honing both your physical agility and mental acuity. For the upcoming partner passing drill, you'll require five cones. Arrange three in a straight line for dribbling practice and position two more cones about three meters apart in front. This drill presents a higher level of difficulty due to its specific pattern. Begin by executing one touch in the middle, followed by two touches on the right cone, then another single touch in the middle, two touches on the left cone, and finally, one last touch in the middle before returning to the dribbling segment. Dribble through the cones however you prefer, then repeat the sequence, initiating play from the left cone to focus on the opposite side. This comprehensive drill targets various aspects of the game, aiding in the refinement of your passing, first touch, and dribbling skills. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to our channel for more content like this. Your support means a lot to us.